Birds flying high, you know how I feel. Sun in the sky, you know how I feel. It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new life, and I'm feeling good. <laughs> What's up, y'all? Mm. It's trash day. I don't know. Sometime I sit out here and I thought of that song. <laughs> I think I said all the words right. If not, y'all know what I was trying to sing. But yeah. <laughs> That's a pretty song, though, when you think about it. All right, y'all. Just came out here real quick. I did morning prayer, and I like to try to come sit out here for a few minutes, then I'm going to get logged on, then at about 9, I'll eat my breakfast, so y'all see I got the oatmeal on, this, on the stove, amen, alright y'all, let's hit it, let's hit it. Okay, y'all, what have I been doing? I've been working out on this walk pad treadmill. I thought it's been so hot to get out and walk. With this Delta variant at going to the gym, it's just not, and uh, it's just not. <laughs> so, happened to be watching TV, and this commercial came on about these became so popular during the beginning of COVID. People would buy these to put under their desk at home so that they would still be able to, you know, exercise. And I thought, you know what? I never thought of that. So I get on this throughout the day. I know I at least do an hour. Like in the morning, I'll get on here and walk 30 minutes. And then throughout the day, I'll do like 10 minutes in between doing my breaks and stuff and I thought you know what I'm gonna go ahead on and buy it I got it off of Amazon it was $2.69 but I thought I ordered the one where you could have the retractable bar rail I'm gonna see if I can get that as an accessory but I pretty much stay balanced but um I love it it's just like a treadmill and then this is the only one that I found that that holds my weight. All the rest of them were, the capacity weight limit was 200. I'm like, your girl's over 200 pounds. So I need one that can hold weight over 200 pounds. So anyway, I love it. It fits comfortably right here in the corner of my office. I just had to move some things around. I love it, I can turn and watch the scenery outside. I can cut my music on. And it has a Bluetooth, it has a Bluetooth where I can play music. It's got speakers on here where you can play music. Um, it's very smooth. 
I'm sure y'all can hear it, but it's not real loud, but no big deal. When you go to the gym and all that noise that makes the equipment. But it goes up to 3.8 miles per hour. I'll never get there. The most I got up to get up to is about 2.8. And that's a real fast walk. But I always start out with 1.8 to warm up. Then I go up to 2.2, up until 2.8, and that's when I'm finishing out. But y'all, this is something I had to do for Tanya, because I gotta keep moving and grooving. I'm not gaining any weight. Um, I'm just gonna try to maintain and of course get lower, lose weight. But I didn't want the heat and me not being able to go to the gym to be a hindrance of, of, of exercising. So I love it. It's very low impact, but I'm walking on it to keep my heart rate up. And it's this is just, this. I, I should have done this when we first um, start working remote. But this is what I've been doing for about the past it's going on two weeks now. And I thought, well, let me wait before I tell the people. I just make it part of my routine. That's why I put it in my office. I said, no, nah, because I was going to put it in my bedroom. My arm's getting tired. And I said, no, put it in your office. Just move some things around. And it fits perfect. But yeah, it's a walk walking pad treadmill it's just like a treadmill it's just not all big and bulky and it does what it needs to do honey love it for 269 i thought that'll pay for itself so anyway i just wanted to let y'all know this is what your girl been doing which is have been causing my hips and legs to be sore because it works you out but anyway let me finish it out Got about 20 more minutes to go. All right, y'all. clean fresh cut grass they come and blow the carport down and everything everything looks nice manicured and they sprayed for weeds because the weeds they just got horrible so he sprayed real good for the weeds thank you Lord Jesus everything's nice and neat Ooh, y'all, it's finna get real hot. Real hot. I can feel the humidity already coming up my neck. Just want to come out here. and Y'all women know how we have to do. We have to inspect stuff, don't we? Try not to expect, inspect too hard while they're working. Come out here later on and inspect. <laughs> yep. Get all the weeds out. All right, and then probably in about another week, maybe two or three more weeks, it'll be time to trim the afros again. They don't look bad; just sort of sprouting out right now. I thought I just saw something move in that reef, in my reef, reef, reef. Huh, child. I tell you what, it better not make no sudden movements. Well, I got to go back in this door. Child. Hmm, maybe it was just the wind. <laughs> I need to, um, this, this, um, this box been sitting here for a minute. I keep forgetting I need to bust it on down, but I'm thinking, should I keep it and just put it in the attic? Because I got, you know, a warranty on it. 
just to make sure it doesn't go to the left. I think I might just do that. I think I'm going to just keep all the packing stuff that came in here. And just take it upstairs and put it in my attic. I think I'm going to do that. Yeah. Anyway, that I know it's upside down, but yeah, that's the name of the walking pad. Y'all, I also got me a new hand mixer. Um, I got it off um, Amazon. It's a Betty Crocker. And I went ahead on and got it because the one that I had, it's, it sounded like it was trying to make a funny noise. So I said, okay, before it burns out, I, I got me a replacement. Um, but the reason why I got this is because it comes with these attachments, but it also comes with that bread attachment. So I said, you know what, instead of me buying a bread maker um, right now, I said, you know what, Tanya, just do it old school. Uh, get get you a hand mixer with the bread hooks so you can make breads, you can make um, pizza dough and all of that, you know, just using, using this. So anyway, and I think it was like 16 bucks maybe on Amazon, not much at all. And uh, the hand mixer I have... My, my current one is by Sunbeam. And um, it's just old. You know, it's getting old. And like I said, um, it is um, was sort of starting to try to stutter. So anyway, I thought, let me go on and get one. And like I said, this is 15 bucks. I like the way it's shaped. And then, again, because of that bread attachment or dough attachment, I should say. I'm going to start trying to make me some, like, yeast rolls and stuff. I mean, you still can do it like they did in the old days. Everything was kneaded by hand. But, hey, we're more modernized, ladies. We can get gadgets and things to help us along the way. It doesn't take away from the fact that we still make stuff homemade. We just have a little help. 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 <laughs> Y'all, I had totally forgot I had bought this when I was down there in Florida at Five Below for your face. Uh, so, yeah, your girl's going to be using it. Yeah. Y'all, y'all look at this. I'm in Wally World. I had to come. I came in here to pick up some creamer. Cause I'm out and uh, I picked up a few more things uh, yeah 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 y'all I'm back home your girl's tired I went to my mom's house I stopped by over there we was over there sleep talking and watched a few episodes of Celebrity Family Feud. We just love it. We, we love Steve Harvey. But, uh, and then I said, let me swing on by to Walmart. I normally do my um, Instacarts on what? Thursdays. But I did it a little early <laughs> this week. You know, had to go to Wild World to get some stuff. Because I was out of creamer. I don't know how I use so much creamer this week. Because, uh. Yeah, but anyway, when I say out, I'm like little drizzle, drizzle left. But uh, anyway, so I did that. I had a few errands I had to run, take care of some business. And so um, I said, well, you know what, girl, go ahead on. It's going to be a long weekend. My birthday weekend is coming up. Well, actually, my birthday is September the 6th on a Monday. But, 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 yeah. Um, it's actually on Labor Day. So how, how forgetful can y'all be? You can't. But anyway, um, so I went on and, you know, got some stuff that I went ahead on and need. I know I'm going to need. So I just did it early, $50 later. Because, you know, some things you have to get at Walmart because uh, it's cheaper. Uh, it's cheaper. Uh, I'm going to say it again. Some things you had to get it from Walmart because it's just cheaper. Alright, y'all. Anyway, I'm watching my show. 
Um, I'm really, I'm really liking the uh, the Potomacs. They're the only ones I watch. For some reason, I just like them. But anyway, let me go. I'm tired. The sleep man is trying to bust a move on me. Oh, honey, she's real pregnant. But anyway, uh, let me go. Love you. God bless. Mean it. And uh, I'll see you on the next video. Bye, y'all.